Welcome to Quick Learning. Today we are going to learn how to find out the material yields of components or raw materials. For this we will be using the transaction MCRP or MCRE. So what we will do is we will write this MCRP transaction or T code in this tab and we will press enter. Then you will see this window will appear in front of you. It has multiple tabs that you need you, you have to fill or you can fill some of these uh, depending upon the type of data that you want to get. So number one is plant, then it's material, uh, component, version, sales order number, sales order item, production lot and date. So first of all, if uh, we start from some uh, wide range, we will just enter a plant number 3005 for example and we enter a range of dates for which we want to get the data of all the raw materials in this particular time span so what we will do is we will press execute then this page will appear in front of you that is saying that for this plant our requirement quantity was 42 million and withdrawal is 36 million okay so withdrawal quantity is less if we further want to get a detailed overview we will sort these up as mentioned here in this table with component wise details with material with version lot etc so what i will do is i will first check with component type entrance so you will see uh, here i am just increasing the width of columns by double click on the component tab and I will enter 40 so this width will be in key so you can see all these components are written here and against each component you can see the requirement quantity and the withdrawal quantity so this is showing us the requirement and withdrawal and to calculate the yield we just need to divide requirement quantity with the withdrawal quantity this will give us the yield or you can say the amount, the quantity which is used in percentage and how much is the wastage. Similarly, for example, for this corn, if we have requirement this and withdrawal is this. Similarly, for this LBL, we have this requirement, this withdrawal, etc. So going down, you can, you can see that uh, for each component, the requirement and withdrawal is written here. For example, we will go back to the main page we will press execute and what i will press the switch drill down f7 in this i will select date when i will press enter it will show me the date wise data of requirement and withdrawal for example on the 2nd of october the requirement was this and withdrawal is this and uh, on 3rd this is the number and uh, continue uh, in, down in the list you can see that these are the details of the requirement and withdrawal quantities against each date so that that, that is the case over here so if uh, what I want to do is I want to get the specific details of some material not for the complete plant for, for this what I will do is I will write the material code material code is like the product code that is made up of multiple components so the component is different material is different material is the end product which is made up of multiple components so I, I write this code here and I have entered the data same and I will press execute and so this will show me that for this material code these are the requirements these are the requirements for this particular material so you can see for this plant this this these plants this is the requirement quantity and this is the withdrawal quantity if we further want to elaborate we can just check it the date wise data so you can see these are the dates and these is the requirement and withdrawal quantity for this particular material because i have entered the material code here similarly going down i will i want to see the requirement and withdrawal quantity or the yield analysis material usage analysis with respect of the component so here i will select one particular component only and i will select you can say let's select the plant 3005 and i will press execute and you can see that uh, 
this plant let me select the plant again it is selected so you can see for this particular component these are the requirement and withdrawal quantities for different plants this is the requirement for Lahore this is for Gujjawala Multan Rahimah Khan Kibjaf so these are the requirements and these are the withdrawal quantities if we just want to uh, check I will just click here and you can see the further details if we want to check date wise for example or the component wise then, then these are the dates similarly if I want to see by, by material so that component is used in these types of multiple materials so uh, its consumption against each material is also shown here and you can just see so this transaction is used in this way you can export the data by just clicking on this material usage analysis and you can go to export and transfer to excel or save to pc file then this data will be transferred to your computer in excel format or spreadsheet or notepad and you can further analyze it based upon your requirement so in this way we have learned how to use the mcrp transaction to get material usage analysis of any component or material or different plants so for any question you can just write in the comments tab please like share this video and subscribe to our channel until next time bye bye